Hi, I'm John. I'm Brandon. I'm Tony. I'm Landon. And I'm Emily. Oh, yeah, she got it then there. And it's game <laughs> misconduct. <laughs> it's the summer games time. Am I blended in with the background? Am no, I bro, beach? I fixed you. Do you want that? You no, guys look so blue and stuff. I think I can finally wear my Dabba Star Dabba Wars. Dabba nice. Uh, we got Landon and Emily in the house. What up, boys and girls? It's been a while. It has been a second. This it's is your first uh, live, live free podcast show. Well, I mean, we did a couple live streams that like we're like we're gonna do live streaming a podcast, like the two episodes that we did it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we just all of a sudden right, our connection just stopped working. No, you know what? Actually, we're gonna do it instead. Yeah, we're gonna do it. I decided to. Brandon and uh, John are acting a fool. Hey, and Danny's <laughs> in the chat. And he says, did someone say Summer Games? Oh, my full Danny. house. Summer Games. And he says, Golden Loot Box. <laughs> yep. We're That's opening right. them on our so air. Okay. Shall, shall, shall we just open these up? I think you should. I, I need your help. Help me press the Dude, button. Dude, give him the power. Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh I got a purple. <laughs> Oh, Ooh, that's a, where are those? That's a dope Dude, who's that golden guy? Mm, he looks that's dope. A dope skin. It's a golden guy. It is a good skin. Sure, why not? It's not coming from my <laughs> well, ears. Why That's not yours. Sure. I, I like that. That little Reinhardt. Uh, Danny says, hey, Emily, and hey, Landon. Oh, hey, Danny. Oh, I've actually Hi, never played this. Uh, uh, it's, uh, How are you today, Danny? I'm it's actually... Like, it's been so long since Don't I talked to you. Clock, clock, More like just All right, let's night. do it. <laughs> Summer Sorry, game. No, yeah, I understand. <laughs> no, this is the first time that I actually am, uh, yeah, on the audio with Danny because oh. Danny was like, you, "Your guys' a super fan." You're like, you found yeah. you guys. He's got the belt right behind yeah, you. Yeah, I know. That's so, how you guys make it. Danny is a really. I keep guy. up the things. I really. Kinda. We've actually finally, for the that. first time, started playing games <laughs> together, which took forever. I realized what it was. That's a little birdie. <laughs> I really enjoyed our time together, Danny. Oh, these are just regular loot boxes. That's a yeah. fire though. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah! Oh, so if you have any questions for Danny, yeah, a little, uh, by all means. I think I mean, are we going to talk over each other? Is that basically yeah, what that's what we do this whole time. Right, cool. It's just a free yeah, game. It's just it's everyone yelling at each other. It's a free for all at the I'll same just, fucking I'll just time. Turn them down a little bit. <laughs> they're turned down. Don't worry about it. <laughs> they're just they're just looking at <laughs> loot boxes. If you guys have a point, just say say something. Say something. Oh yeah, I'm say giving up on you. I'm giving up on you. There he is. That was beautiful. My man. I've, I'm We're known, for, I'm known for my great singing <laughs> voice. So I loved it. Uh, uh, Danny says, I'm great. How is everyone doing there? And also he says, I'm a swell guy. Laughing my ass off. Smiling. You sure are. You are a swell guy, Danny. How is everybody doing, though? It's because you know, whenever you use the word swell, it usually is just kind of like a sarcastic yeah, tone. Uh, yeah. I was praising him a little bit, too. So I'm sorry if I made you feel awkward there, Danny. Such a swell <laughs> guy. How's everybody doing, though? Doing great. You doing, doing well. you doing well, dog? Doing well, dog. You got turned up for a second. Both of you guys, how was your day? Pretty good. It was a, turn it up was a busy day. It was a long day. Can't complain. Dude. That was turned down. A lot of things broke yeah. at work. But I don't like that. I don't like the sound of that. What well, about you two? Well, kind of stunk, but you know what? That's okay. Because... I'm almost level 27. It's nice to be back. Hey, it we're is. in Tennessee, so yes. that's, uh, that's yeah. a uh, plus. You're in Tennessee. It makes the day better. USA. Oh, Danny, I'm do me a favor. Let me know, know how the audio is, is if you yeah, could, in the bad. chat. You're my audio man. Ooh, that's... Dang. Whoa, dude. That looks like tracks. That's dope. The Destroyer. This is also a live feed, just so you know, so there's no delay. I figured. Ooh, so that's a good Oh, that's cool. nice. All right. Um, so right. I'm uh, I'm very surprised at how far the studio has come. Oh, so Danny Landon has not been here since. Holy March. shit! Yeah, it's been a while. And we've recently added the green screen. No, we added the extra May, lights. Right? He drove away so with May? his middle yeah, finger in the air. He came back in May. When was the last podcast? Uh, I'm gonna look it up right now. I have no idea. Here's your I'll, one top I'll ten. See, uh, it's it it's been a long. Oh, it's been a long time. I was down here when you did your top ten. I do know that much. Yeah. So. We've got 18 me. top 10 videos. Can you guys believe that? That uh, cray. Since we've instituted the top 10, it's been there's been 18. So we've done them for 18 weeks now. Okay. Time flies by so fast. Because yeah. that's only a recent addition, I feel. That, that was this year. Well, that's about right, because the baby is five months today. 31 was the last podcast. Yeah. 31, so that right. was... Danny's in... was uh, 13, 12, 12? 13 weeks ago. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, we're on 44. Today's 44. There you go. Wow. Yeah. Jeez. So it's been three months. And to be May. fair, it was probably 14 because um, <laughs> we recorded back to back once, remember? Yep. I remember that. I was going out. That was when I was going. Was that when I was going? No, like Dallas. Doo -doo. 
I was going to Dallas. Okay, there you go. So now we know. Dallas. All right. Yeah, <laughs> you're right. So it's been since May. So we really only added this since May? Lucio Ball. That is true, because this is our sixth or yeah. seventh product podcast pre show. So yeah, it's <laughs> changed a lot in a uh, short amount of time. So. All right. I've never Game of Conduct this. is changing all the time. All the time. We are a forward thinking like you have we, we tried organization. Think of something. No. Something like that. It's like Rocket League. I thought you. I, 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 no, I saw that in the chat, but I thought you said you did. You're a Rocket but League. Uh, Danny says, uh, Landon, you missed so much. I did. Ball, bro. Uh, and then he says, Are we playing Lucio oh, Ball? Oh, and then, Oh God, this oh, is going oh, to be oh. fun. Hey, Danny, where's Lauren? Is she available tonight to play with us? Or no, us I know. I have not seen this game. That's freezing. Oh, they're going to show me knocking it into my net. No! <laughs> Why do you suck so much, John? <laughs> I'm sorry. That was really, that was top notch. I mean, honestly, uh, what is it? What is it? Play of the game? I think like that's play were, of the game, right? You there. look like you were playing for Man United, buddy. No, that's because they suck. <laughs> just Why is it so slow, speaker. bro? Oh, shoot. Because this isn't Rocket League. Oh, that's right. They have to run, Tony. Jeez. Oh, no. They don't got engines on their feet. Dang. We played Rocket League a few weeks back, and it was a disaster. It was a. It was so bad. <laughs> this is really bad. Now, I will say Rainbow Six Siege went really well last week. John picked up the controller and killed somebody like in his first two seconds. He's like, I'm gonna be so bad at this, and then he kills two people. I'm like, dude, are you kidding me? It was a, it was a, re a legitimate kill too. He's a closet ranger. A legitimate clear kill. Oh. Holy shit! You guys are getting just the I piss beat out of you. It. You can do it. I thought I don't look at me. don't let us down. It was a miss. It was such a I'm, miss. I'm already letting you. F and A, down. Cotton. Where's the ball? Where's the ball? Where's the ball? Do you all need beers or anything? Oh, we got beers. You got beers? What about you? Uh, how you doing over there, bird boy? Oh, I'm good. I'm good. Let There's me know when it's time for refills. Okay. I got a full brewski huh? in my brother. Mm, good, because I don't. Do you like blue moves? I don't. Yeah. Push it. Uh, yeah. Here's my thing about the Belgian white. Blue moon. It tastes like markers. I've always said that. <laughs> it tastes like the like the flavored smelling markers in the past. I don't know. That's just my theory. Bumper, I don't taste right, orange. I, I just taste okay. You're yeah, artificial, absolutely right. artificial yep. smell. I, now you <laughs> fucking hold me, and I'll never be able to untaste it. I like shark talk game. I'm sorry. Yeah, shark talk. Let's say that one, right? Yeah. Uh, uh, I mean, there's some Lucy. Belgians, but yeah, no. That, those I forget. It's probably that the, the orange the marker. orange artificial smell. Yeah. Ooh. Sorry, didn't mean to ruin it for you. No, 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 it's kind of no, like no. that one what? time I was hanging out with Amber and Gary, and they were eating their fajitas, and I'm like, oh, that tastes like fish. They ate fish. They're like. Therefore, <laughs> you just ruined my whole dinner. I'm like, thanks. Can I have that to go? <laughs> go, go, go. I'll be here all night. I'll Knock be it here down. all night. All right. Uh, she is passed out. Wahaha. I'm calling hacks. That guy is a robot. <coughs> Who's a robot, John? He's oh, not. <laughs> oh, 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 Brandon. Sorry, brother. Uh, Danny was telling me last night um, that. <coughs> They're bringing in a team deathmatch in Overwatch? Yeah. That sounds awesome because all I want to do is kill people in this game. A little TD action? Can you play as everybody or is it just limited players? I you think know? it's everybody. Two. Is it? One. Interesting. I like it. Airbus. Dude, our Getting teammate kissy. isn't playing. Oh, oh da is Danny uh, playing? Yeah, Danny's playing with us. Oh. He plays with us every week. Oh, nice. He says he owns 250 games. Wow. On his fucking uh, hard show drive, off. yeah, he told me that last night. He's like, I, I, it's, it's. He said it's a problem. Oh, it's a problem. Oh, oh, oh. So he said, if you play the game, most likely I have it. So he asked me, he's like, what are we playing tomorrow? I'm like, mm, probably Overwatch or Rainbow Six again. He's always down for Rainbow. That just not Rocket League. That he played that one week insane. Rocket League with us and we played doubles at one I point. I just want to get our one. Let me get one hit at one time. It was bad. You have to be really good at Rocket League to yeah. play doubles. And even Chris was saying, he's like, I'm Ooh. used to the mouse and keyboard situation, so he was trying. I'm terrible at Rocket League. It's still yeah, fun, though. Yeah, yeah I, I enjoy so playing it. It's going to be fun on Switch. I suck at all games, so, like, <laughs> you know, there's no pressure. No. I can just suck and enjoy myself. You're pretty good at Borderlands. I saw you guys were playing that. I love... Oh, God, I fucking love that. game is fun, isn't it? Yeah. Are you playing split screen or two uh, different consoles? We tried. We were doing split screen, screen but hard. I think we're going to set up two different consoles. Oh, Alright. So. Ah, oh no! Oh no! What happened? Oh, what I love that we're having. It, yeah. this, this is great. I love well, the setup where really, it's just that's really what the a secondary conversation <laughs> going on where two people play games. They're a little bit muted. Oh, no! 
got it! Do the stuff in the games! We got it in the quarter pocket! <laughs> Nice dance job. Is that the one, two, three, four, or five pocket? Look at it. That's yeah, uh, I did try to play Borderlands split screen. It's not fun. It's hard. I, I mean, forget like, those old days of what that was like. Yeah, it's it's, it's not a shutout anymore. Right, Danny, well, and the fact that like, you can't even see your full uh, Danny, play the game. Like, you, yeah. yeah. like, you go into oh, yeah. like the start menu and you have to scroll up and down into the menu. Yeah, like you can actually see it. I'll tell you one that's really good though, if you're wanting to get into that co-op action, is Diablo yes. 3. I was telling her about that. On the same screen is so much fun. Yeah, because it's actually gonna be oh. the two characters on the same yeah. screen at the same time. So Calm like down. if he runs ahead of you, then that's the only time you're gonna get mad at each other. So. Right. Um, and another Ooh, one that actually believe it, Rocket League is Ooh, one that Ooh, really works in split screen. Uh, John and I one day he was hanging out at the house hall. Oh, oh, it was the last time you were here, actually, when we ate the hot chicken. Yeah. We stood in my living room for about three hours just playing Rocket League. You, know, you stood in your living room? Yeah, we stood up. We didn't even sit down. Remember, remember hey, that, John? I do remember that. <laughs> we were just sitting there. That chicken was not feeling good on our tummies, no. so we couldn't sit down. But it was feeling good in your mouth. Oh, yeah, it was. <laughs> that chicken in my mouth. You know what didn't feel good? I went to Hattie B's uh, last month, and I got the damn hot, which is one behind the hottest. Uh -huh. I think they gave me the hottest. I I had problems for days, and that's just me not getting too personal with you. I was burning. It was so. I want to hear more about it. Do you? Okay. Well, it involved a very little amount of toilet paper. You didn't have any toilet paper? Just kidding, I had plenty of toilet paper. Oh, I needed that. Did you have a wet wipes? <laughs> I wish. <laughs> I just had the nice shower. Some cooling mental wipes. Good old wipes. cry in the corner. That's all it was. Good old cry. Oh, man. I've just been violated by only my own stomach. Oh, I had to be some man. Oh, and I went to Hot Stuff last weekend with Liz. How was Hot Stuff? Is it still it good? It holds up. Really well. The, nice. The way they fry the chicken is just out of this world. I remember. Oh, it's super crispy, tried, super juicy. Like Dude, she got the grilled strips, and they were really good. These dudes are pretty. Yeah, but their mild tastes really good. And that's the thing is like you gotta appreciate the just the, the flavor overall. <laughs> Uh, I want to actually be able to taste it if I'm gonna. Yeah, <laughs> that, yeah I'm getting there. <laughs> I'm finally crying, past that phase of my life where I'm like, I don't need this. <laughs> I really don't need this. Another, well, okay, this isn't hot chicken, but the one like hot thing that I can handle is honey hominy. That oh yeah, cheddars. fucking! I the reason I'm I'm getting her hooked slowly hooked to chicken fingers and chicken in general. Went to Cheddar's and they've got a free Honey Habanero chicken fingers. Is that new? Oh, yeah, I, I, didn't, so. I don't think they oh. had that before. It was yeah, so I think good. It's one of their new sauces. I love their chicken tenders. That's the only good thing there. In my opinion. Right. So, it was if you good. go to Cheddar's, I recommend that. <laughs> It was tasty. Sweet Again. and hot. And well, that's the thing Danny's having flashback to Rocket funny. League. <laughs> oh no! What are you doing? He doesn't want to play any more Rocket League! <coughs> it's cheddars. That's what this is. It's we check in and out with the, the game players. You guys have fun over there while we have adult conversations. <laughs> I have to wonder, does the UK have cheddars? Probably not. No, Danny every Friday says he orders Domino's, oh, Domino's and Monsters thing. Energy Drinks. Okay. The thing is, is that Domino's is one of those that has like its own energy. regional sort of flavors too. Because I had, oh. I saw them in Japan and I was like, ah, that's something I've never. Like, it has oh. mayonnaise on there for the sauce, and the, I don't even remember what else they had. But it was. I'm uh, sure I have like squid ink and yeah. like that flavors too. I was playing Rainbow so. with him last weekend and he had he orders Domino's all the time and he said he was eating pineapple and ham, so he was eating an American classic yeah. right there. Pineapple and ham, like the ham is, is amazing. Pineapple is delicious. Hey, all the people that say pineapple shouldn't be on pizza should shut the fuck up. Yeah, we his friend was We're America, we do what the fuck we want with pizza and everything you give us, pineapple. we take it, change it, and make it worse sometimes. Pineapple is great. You wanna hear my perfect pizza? I know, I'm wonderful. And I build this every time at Papa Murphy's. It's pineapple, mushroom. Room. Sausage. So you yep. have bacon. Uh, yes. You're not gonna like this I last like one. Onion. Fuck you. Onion. So good. Onion. Leave the onion off. It's fine. <laughs> Super good. Sausage, bacon, pineapple, and mushroom. Yeah. Fantastic. This I'm good with that. Bad. I couldn't do the mushroom. I would eat that though. Or the sausage. Yes. I'd eat the bacon. Well, and even pineapple. if you throw <laughs> bacon, sausage, or you don't like sausage, and pineapple on there, it's just it's, it adds a different <laughs> salty taste than just Bull. the standard bacon. Right. But I, I, I'm here to tell you, Would bacon, you pineapple, boosty, boosty? hands down, right. better than ham. Oh, Danny loves pineapple on pizza. Yeah, yeah. He does. That's right. That's right, Danny, because He's, pineapple belongs on pizza. This is Landon. Did we just become best friends? <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Danny. Hey, Danny. Oh, did you add? I have. Okay, have you guys been running into the spam accounts on Xbox yet? Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. My fucking God. Yeah. 
Uh, so I've got oh, had like three of them. I'm hoping I didn't. If Danny, if you added me, I don't even know if my Xbox gamer tag. Right? I would set it out out loud or not. Of course, I'm gonna as his name. Okay. Well, I'll look you up. I'll find you, or yeah. you can find me. Whatever. You need to get Siege and come play with us. Well, he'll play with us when we play Destiny too, as well. So. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna probably pick up Destiny too. One thing you'll learn about Danny is he never sleeps. Literally never sleeps. <laughs> he told me the other day he slept three hours in the last 48. So, but he just hates it. So he'll <laughs> always be willing to play. Isn't that right, Danny boy? Had so many spam accounts. Yeah, no, uh, Emily was playing Borderlands, and I didn't, I haven't run into one, and before this, and someone messaged her, I was like, hey baby. Hey, no, uh, hey hun. Hey hun. So it sounded like, you know, super, Somebody you super might innocuous, know. well yeah, or like even just a Somebody female, being, yeah. or something. But yeah. not they're like, how are, or what was it, how old are you, and are you, I don't remember, but they were like, I'm a 22F. Yeah, at that point, oh, I, I grabbed like, the thing and said, fuck off, and then you're a spammer, and then closed it, so. I just delete all that stuff. But I'm as soon as you, now I know, as soon as you see, like, s some name and then random numbers, that's, you just get rid of them. Yeah. yeah. I'm about to make a beer run. Anybody need any more? Yeah. What do you want? Blue Moon? Yes, sir. Okay, what about you? Blue Moon? Yeah, please. I'm good. You good? Yeah. yeah. Moon, blue moon. Yeah, he's got drive. Uh, <laughs> no, Johnny? I don't have any orchard. Moo Bloom. I don't have any orchard. Uh, if I want you money, will you... Wait, where are you going, public? He's not... Oh, the refrigerator. <laughs> 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 I'm sure we can intercept Liz. Go to the refrigerator. <laughs> Man, I miss public. probably wouldn't want to. She's been working all day. Never mind. We'll find out how she feels when she gets home. And then we'll see if she'll run on a go on a beer run. Yeah, right. Get home and then have to immediately turn around. Of course, so bad. I'm just gonna hide in the corner. Just we might not be playing Lucio Ball much more. <laughs> Lucio Ball. What's the purpose of me? Obviously, you're all you're all um the Lucy the yeah no no that is the character's name from Overwatch Lucio. Gotcha. Yep. No, uh, I have no I idea about Overwatch, Overwatch, and Emily doesn't have any idea about Overwatch because I, I'm a grad student and have no life. Yeah, other than grad student stuff. At least you went to college. It is true, but sometimes. And that's right. actually only the college educated know actually how you pronounce col college. <laughs> so. Um, Brandon, did you go to college? I did go to college. Yeah. Yeah, see, he knows, because he graduated college. Right, yeah. <laughs> I say. Thank you, brother. It's man. just like Tarjay. You gotta be part of the elite. Thank you, my brother. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Danny hang on. says, can we back out and find another lobby after this game? Yes, sir, we will. We have the same teammate not playing. Ugh. Oh. Let me know when. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, oh. See, he should have been right there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god. I think we might need to blur that out in the recorded version. Yeah. The only thing that would make that better is if that there was, was one with bottle <laughs> nipples on it. <laughs> that would be good. You need I got nipples on it. Tony would let it go. Go, <laughs> 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 no, Danny. Go, no, Danny. Oh, no, Danny. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, Danny. Yeah, Brandon, go, Danny. No eating here tonight. No, no, no eating here tonight. We're on a diet. <laughs> Are there any other games in the summer no games idea. than whatever this is? No, just this. Is that it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Do you get any special unlocks for playing this playlist? Uh, you get the summer games loot boxes. You, you, you get them at, after you win, I think. You win. The match you get. Wins. After you win, you win? <laughs> And then after a certain time period, you get some more. And as a game is conduct special tonight only, we will buy you a hooker. Oh. Okay. Well. Only if you subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Who's, well, how many people are let's watching? See how many viewers There's, we got here. It's, it's just me, you, and Danny. <laughs> For watching, there might be one more in there. Yeah. So there well, we go. That's probably my parents. <laughs> you gonna buy? Yes, I am serious. You gonna buy? What, you gonna buy your dad a hooker? Mm. No. <laughs> Gross. Well, to be fair, you'd have to buy your mom a hooker, too. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Gotta be fair. Hooker, right? Danny, get in there, my friend. Seriously, though, you gotta get on that rainbow so you can play it. Danny, so much fun. Friend. You should get it, too. Do you like playing shooters? Yeah, I do. Fucking uh, I I've tried to play Rainbow Six. It does not work for me. Really? I've never, Dude. I've it's never just so, played it. It's, Overwatch? Here's my biggest complaint about Have shooters. Have you tried Rainbow 7? <laughs> <laughs> my biggest complaint is if I get the, the drop on somebody, and I shoot them a couple times. Did you just say Rainbow 7? Yeah. <laughs> you son of a bitch. They don't die. 
And like the Call of Duty, sometimes they'll turn around and shoot me. I'm like, how the hell did you not die? Rainbow's like, you get the drop on somebody, they're dead. If you shot them three times in the chest. And uh, that's just, it's so well balanced. Wait, so is it closer to what Call of Duty has for like a shooting? No, it's a stri it strategy shooter. Yeah, it's realistic shooting. Um, that's, yeah, that's what I meant. <laughs> it's like, like running running quick running rounds, but quick rounds, like you die, you're done. Mm -hmm. uh, then he says you don't have to play this to get the summer games boxes. Oh, so you can play something else. No one asked you. <laughs> Danny? <laughs> I thought you were a big Rainbow fan back in the day. We played Terror I like the Vegas ones, but th this new one, uh, I mean, you let me play it that one time and immediately got in a helicopter, didn't know what I was doing, and crashed. Helicopter? No, that was, uh... That was Wildlands. Wildlands, okay. Yeah, Rainbow Six is it's just multiplayer. Gotcha, interesting. And it's like, all the updates are free, uh, with the exception of, like, the operators, you can pay money to get them unlocked instantly, or you just pay hmm. with your currency. It's like Overwatch, but with, uh, tactical shooting, but... It's super fun. Super fun if you got a squad. It's not so fun if you go on your own. That's the thing is I really enjoy playing games more in groups, but I don't have friends that yeah, enjoy playing. Sad, like, I keep recommending people to get it, and I keep forgetting that Destiny 2 is coming out, and that's going to change all of our lives yeah. for, the, for the bad. Um, the I will be here when Destiny 2 comes out. Yeah. Uh, uh, we're going to be playing it on the stream nonstop, and I'm going to have my screen on as well, so we won't even be talking to the chat. <laughs> Danny will be here too. Oh, damn it, Destiny 2. I don't know if I'm ready for this, sorry, buddy. I haven't looked at anything on Destiny 2, to be honest. We played the beta, and I, I shouldn't have played the beta. <coughs> I was, like, convinced I wasn't going to get it, and then I played the beta. It's just, it's just so well-balanced now. I, don't I hate care that. about this garbage. Like, I actually, for the first time in forever, want to play the Crucible, and I hated the Crucible. What's... That was, that's just What's the Crucible? Back out, they say, Danny says back out. Back out. The Cruci did you play the beta? Right? <coughs> What's that? Of Destiny? Yes, yeah, sir. But the Crucible was on point, man. Because they, they eliminated that 6v6 big maps and just made it 4v4 like old Team Slayer maps from Halo. <laughs> it's so good now. Well, It I'm really sorry. is. And this was without like unlocked weapons, too. So I can only imagine once we start getting our Is weapons. the story any better? <laughs> I hear the story is. I don't know. I play those, though. Honestly, I, I mean, the story, yes, that's a, that's a crucial component, but... But you didn't really I'm need going it. for multiplayer now. You don't. You, uh, it's like Diablo. I'm you sorry. I'm, so, I'm sorry. If you come across, if you come across Bungie, which, in my opinion, created Halo, which was is actually a really good story with fleshed out characters and fleshed out ideas, and then they continued it on, and then they come out with Destiny, which is Destiny basically did have that. is basically Halo, but slightly less uninspired. It did have that. They just separated it into this grimoire. It has Most stupid lore. You just have to Halo dig, and that's the problem. Then he says, "Invite me." And what's what's Danny up? He says, "Invite him." I already did. Um, I already did. Most of the most of the Bungie folks that did Halo are still at three four three. Welcome. Yeah, I know a lot of them. Uh, so you just have so. the main guys that are uh, well, like the original founders of Bungie that are doing the testing. But These I'm a story guy. So that's really what it the story was there. You just had to Which dig, is funny, and you had to be super. <laughs> Because they didn't fucking follow the story of Shadow no, no, of War. Like, okay. Okay, so you played it again recently. You I were did. going ham on it. it was I, fun I, I, I completed it as much as I could, and then I just turned, I, I deleted it. So Yeah, I I, 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 I got to a point where I was just like, I'm done. Uh, but I am so ready for Shadow of War just for that Nemesis system. They have taken that it to another amazing. level. The Nemesis system is the coolest thing of that game. Yeah. Guess what, guys? Kelebrimbor sucks ass. There's what? some John news about that game. Oh! You nice don't plug. like Kelebrimbor? No! You ruined it! Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, he's kind of an ass. Like, they made him like Vianor in the. I, I think I was just more of a fan of how they brought him into the scenes. I thought it was super well directed. You know how they'd be sitting there talking to that one uh, lady that was taken over by Sauron? And like all of a sudden she'd be like, stupid as shit. just come around a corner and then all of a sudden he was standing there. And I'll be like, that's just so cool. There was no kingdom on Nern. We're about to get Nern here. Nah, I'm good. I won't. Oh, I got a copy of The Hobbit down there. I, I bought one at McKay. It's that 30th anniversary, or 50th, whatever. The, the green is. cover? Yeah. yeah, I have that. Oh, do you? Yeah. It's so cool, isn't yeah. it? With the white you know what really sucks that. about it is that I really want, um, there's actually the Hobbit Facility yeah. Edition. Facility? Facility. Yeah, there you How go. How much is that? 
Uh, it's only UK, I think. Dang. But it's actually Danny sent it to us. It's actually the <laughs> first, ed- so it's like the first edition of the Hobbit no! with all the stuff that didn't link to the Lord oh, of the Rings. He changed the story. Yeah, he did. And uh, so, yeah. didn't his publisher ask him to make the Lord of the Rings? Kind of. Well, a lot of people sent fan letters to make the Lord of the Rings to make a sequel. Make like a sequel yeah. because that was a kid's book, wasn't he? Wrote it for children, didn't he? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. I actually listen to, uh, they have this podcast called Movie Fight, where it's like they pick like a director or somebody and like why they're better than another. Screen Junkies does it. Mm-hmm. And they had Elijah Wood on there and he knows so much about it because obviously because he was in uh, Lord of the Rings where he was just spouting off all this knowledge. Did you know that the Beatles originally wanted to make a Lord of the Rings movie and have, uh, what's his name, Kubrick? Directed. Holy shit! And they wanted to play. Wanted like Paul McCartney wanted to play like Gollum and stuff. It was like horrible idea because you know back in the seventies, Lord of the Rings was huge. Yeah. Or like wearing something like Frodo lives. Yeah. The, I get mis- misconstrued the entire yeah. concept of Lord of the Rings, but whatever. But I did not know that. And he's just like, yeah, it was. It was uh, previously like they tried to make it before Stanley Kubrick. The guy but yeah, I mean, shiny. I don't know. Like Kubrick could have pulled it off. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So. Really good I don't know. It, it, it ended was, up in uh, the right hand. Two thousand one. Space Odyssey, that's... Is that Kubrick? Eyes wide shot. Yeah, shut. that's Kubrick. Uh, Kubrick did the uh, oh, no. Shining, no, Clockwork Orange. Uh-huh, uh, Clockwork Orange. I liked the Clockwork Orange. It's because he, uh, I mean... He's a great director. Yeah, and he was. He did. He did. No. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah. But, yeah. I I think if anyone could have done it in the seventies, it would have been Kubrick. Yeah. But I don't Peter think I don't think I don't think the Beatles should have been in it. No, no, no. <laughs> Peter's the man, not so much on the Hobbit side, but he nailed it for the Lord of the Rings. I feel. I, I, I think in terms of adapting it to a theatrical cut, yes, he did. He, he did. definitely nailed it. And the extended, extended editions are yeah. the extended. He did that one for the fans. Still not watched. Like, you haven't watched all the extended editions. For the the Lord of the Rings or the Hobbit? Lord of the Rings. Oh yeah. I'm still on the last no, the side. Hobbit. The Hobbit is still pretty terrible, okay. extended editions wise. I gotta watch those. Ah! The second one is the worst. The second ah! one is garbage. Oh, they it just started that shit. Yes. The third yeah. one is actually okay. The I need to watch. All, that's the only one I've seen. It's got rated R. Yeah, for that's extended all edition. There's like a lot of blood in the Battle of the Five Armies. Hmm. So let me ask you. Uh, Right You've watched Game of Thrones? Three, yes. Okay. Two, Has any of this one, recent pictures and footage from Game of Thrones and like made you itch at all to get back to the universe? I don't give a universe? fuck about Game of Thrones. Okay. So, are you still wanting to finish the books? Probably not. Okay. I'm about done with Art Martin. Uh, and not his... even the dragons, bro? No, I don't, I don't care. They, for the first time, depicted a dragon. There's a dead ass on the battlefield. Bro, last week... They did these scenes. Uh, or, the have you heard anything about it? The yeah, the da- dragons attacked, whatever. Well, yeah, the, the, the Dothraki riders they attacked uh, the Lannisters uh, in the what's field. It called? Um, the, the, the main city, whatever. No, they just met in the field. Oh, okay. Um, well, no, okay, so no, the Unsullied. This is super. Yes! Sp- this is Fuck sp- me, Johnny! Go! Johnny, your head is cut off on the string. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, did you see what I did? Just add in a graphic of Look blood falling down. Oh, baby! Oh, dear. Uh, spoiler alert for Game of Thrones if you've not seen it. I'm about to talk to it too. Landon Landon's a big fan of the books, or was up was. until this point. Uh, so I'm about to un- uh, unpack just this one scene that happened in last week's episode. Unpack so if you don't want to hear it, get out of it. Um, the Unsullied took uh, Castle <laughs> Rock. Mm-hmm. But they moved on to. Uh, what do was not it? Hey, where did they move? Play. John! Do not play this game with me. Where did the Lannisters move? It was, uh, where is the fucking... So they went to High Garden? High Garden. Okay, so they moved to High Garden. The ty- Tyrells. He took out the Tyrell lady. Uh, Marjorie no, already dead at this point. Uh, but they grabbed all the gold. Then he says, you fucking beast, go! Sorry. <laughs> they grabbed all the gold from High Garden to pay off their debts. Why did I not get to play the game with you? They're on the way to the bank, the or they might have just been there. And Daenerys gets pissed off because her whole strategy is taken. Uh, Castle Rock is spoiled, and she decides, all right, I'm going to take my own man. I'm not listening because Tyrion's advising her. I'm just going to take my dragon, Drogon. I'm going to fly him over there. And the Dothrakis are going to finally get their first taste of blood. And it, it's funny. I saw this really funny uh, picture of a meme. And it's, there's a scene from this where they're coming down this hill. It's Dothraki riders and the Lannisters are just standing there like, oh shit. And back in the first season or the first book, Robert Baratheon literally said, a fool would meet a Dothraki rider in open field combat. And it, like the exact thing happened. But they just depicted this because Jamie's there. It's Jamie on one side and Braun and then uh, what's her name? Daenerys. And just the way that this dragon just incinerated people. 
I don't know who the director was, but he he deserves rewards, man. It'd be like this perspective, long ass drawn out scene. You see Jamie he turns over, this oh, the flames come shit. through, people are standing in place, and then they just turn to ash. It is so, I, and nobody knew it was coming. We were just like, it was like the craziest oh scene I've ever seen on the show. So, what is your main gripe though for not wanting to come back? Is it because it's too dark, or you just kind of checked out? It's it's not Walking right. Dead. Here, Walking here. Dead is the Nickelback of TV. Yeah, in my opinion. Walking Dead. Walking Dead is basically a show that just went on for too long. To be fair to Game of Thrones, it will complete a story that yeah, there's that, nine episodes. Like left. it's gonna be a complete series, and it's, that's great. Okay, that's it, Johnny. It's okay. But um, Game of Thrones. Uh, the problem uh, with, for, for me, Game of Thrones is uh, they. Martin is on this. They've ruined characters to the point where I just don't care about them anymore. And um, when you take like, so you're you're saying like Peter Jackson did justice to the characters of Lord of the Rings. That's exactly true because he did justice, and they may not be exactly the same, but they still have their main components to them, their essence as a character. Jamie Lannister raping his own sister. Fuck you. Yeah. Fuck the creators who did that, and fuck all that. Sh like just. Fuck it. And at that he point, he was starting to get good in the books. Apparently. Yes. No. Jamie Lannister was actually learning from. Um, oh, what's your name? The uh, Brienne of Tarth. Which they did in the show. Like he was learning, and he was actually being good, and like they make love on the body of like in the books, which is still fucking gross, but whatever. But no, it's just they they take these characters that I really really enjoyed, like Lady Stoneheart. They don't include them. And I, be fair, like Lady Stoneheart is kind of a minor character, but she's still like leading this resistance against the Lannisters and trying to kill the Freys and all that stuff. Oh, nice. But, I think uh, you would respect who they've taken care of to take care of the Freys. I know, I know who it is. It's Arya. Arya. Yep. Holy hell. Yep. I, it's just. I don't know. I, I have no. If the they season, have limitations, okay. and there's a lot of fluff in Mor Martin's books, from what yeah, I understand, yeah. he wrote himself into many corners he couldn't back himself out of. So if the series comes out, so and they I just find it skip that shit, and I find it cheap, and I find it cheap, I'll buy it and watch it. But I it's don't, good. I don't care enough to go buy a fucking season, HBO Now subscription. The one season I know it. you're referencing that started making me hate it with, uh, you know, Jamie raping, and then you had Sansa get raped. Mm -hmm. They they definitely learned a lot from that season because these last two seasons have been some of the greatest film or TV shows. Like in terms of just all right, let's just wrap this up. That's what they say. We're wrapping this up. There's no more delay in this. Let's just get it over with. And I, I think that's what I respected the most about out of it because so many shows oh, yank your it chain. Is, it's like the last there two is. seasons of Breaking Bad. Hmm. Remember how that first one you're like, oh damn. Yep. Every episode you're like, oh damn. And then yep. the, and then the nice. last one is like, shit, shit, shit. That's all they're doing right now. Yeah. And it's because they're like seven and six. That's all they're yeah. doing. And. The and I season, absolutely holy, respect no. them for that. Now, the, the only thing I don't really respect them for is having two other uh, spin-off spin shows. But they're being not starting the It's, kind, days, of, it's yeah. kind of. But they're not. It's a cash cow, and they're gonna fucking. Oh yeah. Until well, it that's dies. HBO. Many right. said they're, they're not doing anything with that. They're doing a, a show about if the Confederates won the Civil War. Which is yeah. fascinating to me. Which is also which has been done over and over again. <laughs> but <laughs> with them helming it, like that's a. That's gonna be a, a decent show. Have you watched Westworld? No. Oh, okay. That's another. Show. Once again, oh, I do not care enough about HBO to pay their twenty dollars monthly bro, premium. Oh man, I was only fifteen, bro. The only holy show. fuck! I paid ten dollars for Netflix. The only shows I watch are on HBO anymore. You know what's great? It's coming out. Defenders. I'm gonna watch that shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that'll be good. Yeah. I'm watching one right now. It's actually nominated for an Emmy. It's called The Night yeah. of. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, that's, that's good as shit. Head. Dude, what is that? Is I, that Netflix or HBO? It's HBO. And I, I just yeah, don't know it? how they Night have these mini series. What is it? Yeah, what's it about? It's, it's a crime drama, but I honestly oh, I, I don't want to spoil anything, but I didn't know what I was getting into I the first episode. And I was like, little yellow <laughs> things, you, you remember the guy from uh, oh, Rogue One? Uh, <laughs> kind of uh, Arab looking guy. Uh, what was his name? He died in the ship. He was the Rias. pilot. Rias. There you go. Uh, he's the main guy. Sorry, I can hear you over there. But uh, he's uh, he's the main character, and also the guy from Transformers, the real kooky guy. That was. Did you see Revenge of the Fallen? No, none of them. Okay, he was the only good part of the movies. Yeah, but he's he plays the lawyer. It's just super well done. Like every single night, I want to watch it. I get it. It's expensive. Media is expensive right now. And Netflix is the best value for what you're gonna get. Although Landon said that Disney's breaking off too. Yep, Disney's breaking. They're still trying to get their stuff though. I read that today. Netflix. Here's the thing for me in media is that I have limited time and uh, 
if I'm going to invest time in it, and it's going to be something that I absolutely love. Damn. Oh, that's why I only have a handful of shows I watch now. It's all right. I'm trying to read books. I never have time for books. I'm reading Ready Player One right now. I'm going to just steamroll it tomorrow. That's my my goal. I'm like on page 140. It's only like 350. I'm like, I'm going to finish it tomorrow. That's that's my goal after we're done. But. Have you read that book? No. It's really good. The Ready Player, Ready Player of, One. Uh, They're making a movie about it. I know you guys yeah. are really big into like uh, writing, but I mean, he's got some things that are kind of childish, but the source material is really fun. I heard there's a bunch of references and all that stuff, and the movie poster actually has like the Iron Giant as the. There's, it's all 80s That's references, nice. and it's like, imagine a world where virtual reality consumed your everyday totally life. Yeah. And uh, that's what it is. I think it's. It reminds me of Tron. In I think way. it's interesting that we're getting through like we had a really big like uh, 90s uh, um, nostalgia period, mm -hmm. and now we're getting to like the 80s Still nostalgia kind of period. Yep. 80s like, is the like Stranger Things. Yeah, like Stranger Things is Stephen a huge Stephen King's one. coming back. Like yep. Stephen King's a big thing right now. Yeah. He's he was huge in the 80s. Yeah, no, you're right. The 90s is still kind of as a nostalgia period, but like the 80s the is Tower like sucked. it's like going really big. <laughs> the Dark Tower. Did you go and see it? That movie sucked. Yeah, I didn't see it. I borrowed it from the internet. <laughs> well, if uh, that ever becomes really illegal, Brandon's going to jail because he just submitted it on a live stream. It's going to be on YouTube. <laughs> so is it not worth watching at all? Hell no. Oh, damn. I borrowed it from the internet. <laughs> I'm sorry. I really wanted to see that movie, too. It looked good. Because I love Idris Elba. Not in theaters, brother. Seriously, don't. Oh, they converted an eight-book series into an hour-and-a-half movie. It's so condensed. Come it, on. Yeah. Wait, so they didn't even make it like a series of movies? No, it should no, have they been were gonna, done like yeah. Lord of the Rings, but... They started on the fourth book. How does that make sense? That's like Aragon, right? I, mean, like, you know, I understand it, that movie like, was like based off of a really long book, and it was like nothing. Yeah, Aragon was sad and awful. Graphics well, really well, the, cool. well, the books got really bad too in Aragon. But yeah, like, I don't. That's like, as a what, teenager. Four? I was about yeah. to rip that. There are four, right? I think I read through the third. Right? I don't yeah, even yeah. Read the I read the third one. one, and the third one was terrible. Yeah, yeah those things. I, know, like, well, I, was like, oh, I don't like you anymore. <laughs> yeah, so. I'm, I'm trying to read more. I got it coming. I kind of want to read it. I never read any You're Stephen start King. You're going to start getting to Stephen King, aren't you? Oh, yeah, I would I, like I'm to really pick. I would like to read stuff. The Dark Tower. I watched The Shining for the first time two weeks back, and I really enjoyed it. I understand it's so different from the book, so I'm kind of going to. Dude, Search his stuff is expensive. Do you know how much a first edition? I wanted copy to cry on how bad The Dark Tower was. <laughs> oh, this is Danny. <laughs> yeah, it looks so good. Mm. But like a first edition copy of it on eBay goes for a hundred bucks. You're talking about first edition of any bullshit. Uh, any book. Really? Any, bu any book. Well, even like old covers of this damn thing was 50 bucks. Yeah. But I mean, mind you, the movie's coming out. You still have that uh, that Game of Thrones book? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, I might catch out next season. Let me start <laughs> yeah. The last season that I show, that, people that might are going to be scrambling. Be a, a good idea. Yeah, that uh, thing's worth let's some break money. it down! Yeah, to Tony and I, uh, this is a story, I think, I don't know if we ever share, shared it on a podcast, but mm -hmm. we were going through a Barnes & Noble, oh, and they had, uh, like, these, uh, Song of Us and Ice and Fire hardcover, uh, like, it was a blue hardcover, for, like, $10? It was eight. It was eight dollars. It was super cheap. And we should have bought them all. Yeah, we should have bought them all. <laughs> we should have bought them all, because, uh, apparently they, uh, this publishing company didn't have the rights to it or something like that, so they published this book. And they started publishing the second one. The second one's even rarer. But the first book, the reason why it was on clearance was because they weren't supposed to have, they weren't supposed to have it. Oh. And so uh, now they're going over like $100 on eBay for these. these. I just got it sitting down there, yep. just chilling. Same with me. Oh, cute boy! Cute boy! Yeah. That's probably one of the best finds we ever had. The <laughs> they did make, I don't know if it's rare anymore, but they did make leatherback uh, versions of the first five. five. Interesting. And it's, uh, it's nice. Good I just can't read those books, boy. man. Margins are too thin, and they're just so dense. Uh, I like his books a lot. Really? Oh man! Well, you're a reader. You, you got to be a reader Martin. to enjoy his stuff. And I even watch the shows, and I'm like, oh, I can't. I, but I will say, Tyler Blankenship, uh, he was on the show a couple weeks ago. He, he's a huge fan of those books. He listened to them audio. He's like, I like them way more than the show. So. Yeah, because he says they cover stuff like Dorn so much better. Well, it actually that shows, shows just, like, just how far uh, uh, Martin. Is probably like is, he is modern day in terms of Tolkien, how far he, he created into a into a, a, a world. Yeah, how much of a world he did create. Hey, what you doing? You eating pizza? And uh, 
I would argue against it, but whatever. Uh, in terms of a, a modern day figure, yeah, she's uh, history, like in the books. But she created a universe. Yeah. And books, like that's hard to do. Exactly. That people and, like, care about. Yeah. It's, and it's one of those things that when you have that in the background as the writer, uh, so powerfully impacts the stuff the myth that also actually gets out yeah. and, like, on paper. Oh, I, thought he was gonna score again. I, I cannot wait for Stranger Things 2. Oh, fucking Stranger Things. I don't know what Martin has, but... I've heard more Martin has he, positive he, things he, about he, You know what he said in the interview, and it speaks so much truth to why he's not finishing this? He says, to me, I don't want to know how my books will end, because then I lose interest. When he signed that deal with HBO, they made him tell him how it was going to end, and he's lost, lost interest. interest. That's exactly what happened. He lost interest. I mean, he's just like, mm, I don't care. He's never going to finish those books. No, he'll die. Fat Santa Claus that he is. I, I did watch an interview. Oh yeah, he is. He likes cheeseburgers. I, I like watched an interview with him sitting down with Stephen King in front of a bunch of people. Cheeseburger. That's like two of like the biggest modern day writers. Oh, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. JK is kind of a listen. I love I love Harry Potter, but JK is definitely a low end on that scale in my opinion in terms of well, she, what she writes. I mean, she caters to young adults, yeah, whereas Martin's adults. like. R-rated, triple X-rated, whichever. Oh, baby! The thing of it is, is that you don't... Oops, I just I, broke that. Um, you don't need to cater to young adults to make... To make a story compelling to young adults. Yeah. If that makes any sense. That's true. I mean, because like, when I was 14, I was still reading books that were like, definitely for adults and whatnot. Liz was saying that she was reading It, which from what I understand is like... NC-17 quality, which I was like, when I saw that movie was rated R, I was like, what? It's got a bunch of children in it. How do you rate a movie R if it's got children in it? But yeah, apparently, apparently there's... Dark oh, stuff. Like no, there's sex. some... Yeah, there's some sex scenes between they the children. They create, like, so. a bond between the group. Sex yeah. scenes between the children? There's, like, child porn in that one. Yeah, you just leave those close. children undiddled. That's the <laughs> oh reason why. Oh, God! Brandon! I said leave him undiddled! It's like, <laughs> that's too bad! We get close to the line and Brandon just fucking jumps it. <laughs> you just went speeding off the hill! Brandon is- The man that fingers his sister on a horse, a that was- Oh, uh, what? She, what? Uh, Brandon uh, is Greyjoy. evil Knievel. <laughs> when it comes to fucking crossing a line. Guys, watch this! I'm gonna jump 20 buses! <laughs> <laughs> fucking diddle your sister! <laughs> <laughs> and there's the buses. There it is. <laughs> three, We've talked two, gray lines. Greyhounds, or whatever the fuck they're called. Gray lines. Gray lines. Gray Joyce. Gray Joyce. Dion. Who's still a bitch. Literally, literally watches his sister have a knife to his throat and says, uh, Jump in the water. After he did it, They're like, he's like, I tried to save her. He tried to save My her. My ass, you be here. fucking pussy. You jumped off the ship. He jumped off like a fairy, too, bro. I loved his interaction with Jon Snow, though. This, what does that mean, Brandon? He, <laughs> <laughs> it was like me and Kirby when, when you yelled at me in Super Smash. <laughs> I will say Jon Snow. Chris is here! Oh, sweet! What's up, Chris? Nice. Jon Snow's turned into a little I just got star. off the phone. He's yelling. He's in all caps. He's yelling. He's in all caps. <laughs> Caller ID said, Cutler J. Jay. Jay Cutler. Oh! <laughs> he says, hey, John. Yeah, I'm going to read it for you again, uh, Johnny. Oh, oh Danny! He says, hey, Johnny, I just got off the phone. Caller ID said, Cutler J. <laughs> He's wearing his dolphin shirt. <laughs> Jay Cutler signed with him. Was that this week? The phone call was intercepted. <laughs> But before that's I could pick it up, the phone call was That's how my NFL season's going. The only good thing about the only Chris, Chris fucking shows up, immediately burns John. He's like, and I'm out. Oh my god, that was... Chris, you're a beautiful man. We miss you. When you come back, you coming back next weekend, let us know. Sports ball going right now. Is it sports ball season? Shit, I don't know if I'm ready. I gotta get it's ready always sports ball season. <laughs> nice, Danny. Nice shot. Nice, Dan Dan. Yeah, I don't know if I'm no, ready for field. fantasy football. Field. Look at him. He's like, I got this. <laughs> the phone call was intercepted. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will say the only good thing about Jacob. 
He had his best year with Adam Gates. And they went like three and thirteen. No, he did. What did he? What did he go? He actually had his best QBR. I think they almost playoffs. No shit. Sure. Almost. Went almost. Almost. Landon this year. It's, it's and Emily. Year, so. Hello. Hello, Chris. Chris, when you coming into town? You coming into town next weekend for the Rockman party? Eight nineteen. No, no, it's definitely, it's definitely Alan. Victory! Oh, yeah. Chris, you gonna come meet my girl? <laughs> play of the game! Ooh. Santa Claus! <laughs> Danny got play of the game, but Black Santa Claus is dead. Here he goes, look at Nobody Danny! Oh, okay, we're good, we're good. Danny! He says it's landing! I love my friends. Oh. You're the cute boy. Hey, Danny, you gonna make time for us on uh, Destiny 2, or are you gonna have too big of a crew? We, you just need to let us know now. Oh, Chris is gonna be there Saturday. Oh, good deal. I'm so excited. But, Danny, though, we seriously need you, and if you can make time for us, we need you to carry the team. Hope so. here. Carry the team. Dude, you should have seen him when we played Destiny Beta. He had like 30 kills in one match. It was insane. Do you remember that, Johnny? Well, it's just lots of hair. <laughs> Do you remember that? What? When Danny was playing. Put on your headphones, game. Johnny. <laughs> oh, Danny just. He's got Herbal Essence commercials going on. <laughs> this here. Maybe it's Maybelline. This is the longest I've had my hair in like two years. And it's not long at all. Planning for stretch days. Ah, uh, Danny says he'll Planning always for cheek have time for us. Oh, you're the sweetest. You're the sweetest. Oh, so cute. Ooh, I don't know who saved that, but good oh, yeah. Thank you. Come you got it. <laughs> Alright, so in about nine minutes, we'll start the podcast. Uh, yeah, there's a movie of the highest quality. Nope. Landon and Emily have to leave at a certain time, so we're going to start at 8 o'clock sharp. So, actually, I really, drive I, I really would like Liz Minnesota. to come home. So tired. Minnesota. Oh, you are, dude? Yeah. Why aren't you flying, Chris? I can pick you up, buddy. You can stay in my room. It's not creepy at all. Boy, are his arms tired. Oh, turn it up. <laughs> Or are you done in Minnesota? Ooh, know. nice deflect. I'd like to hang out with you at the state fair when I'm up there. How Ooh. is Minnesota State Fair? Are you gonna ride some rides? No, Minnesota. apparently it's all about food up there. Oh, okay. They're right. like known for their food. Oh, that's right. Andrew Zimmer uh, from Bizarre Foods. He does he a lot of like, stuff in um, Minnesota State Fair because he lives in Minnesota. Yeah. So uh, yeah, she she will not fire. stop putting this on a yes. Dad jokes. Oh, she meaty. Make. <laughs> Damn it. She will not stop putting this on a pedestal. So I hope it's good. It's I've heard it's amazing. So and I've seen the shows and I want to be there. Yeah, I would eat that. It's deep fried, fried butter. butter. I don't think I, that, but. Uh, I Chris, mean, all of this is just super buttery bad at that point. Chris, are you not going back to Minnesota? I can pick you up from the airport, just in case you didn't hear me. Okay, you were, dude, that guy's got blinded by it, or deafened by my screams. This is such an interesting game. Get that motherfucker out of here, dude. I've had three beers. Oh, Liz is home. Oh, no. Oh, I thought you had that. I Brandon. thought that was a certain goal, goal, brother. Two and a half at best. Okay. <laughs> Shout out to Liz, she did her first podcast last week and she did a great job. But yeah, it was, uh, I saw her and I actually made the thumb. No, I was no, like, no. Holy no. shit. It's yeah. Liz. Well, we needed another person to do the review because John and I agree on everything, Ooh. so it's kind of hard to get a review and not get too about it. There it is, cute boy. She decided to do that and cute boy. sat for the whole thing, so. You blend it up as much as you want to, bro. Yeah, because you're getting me loot boxes. I didn't know if she wanted to because she would work all day. <laughs> Give me some XP. She just doesn't want to do it. XP. I know. Look at him dancing. She works Check 12 hour shifts. She got to work tomorrow too. Three in a row. Three in a row? Yeah, and then she's off Ooh. seven days. Yes. That's nice. Right, seven days. Yeah. yeah oh! Nice. Work you hard, but they give you some time off. That's yeah. nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. That's Let's a goal. Chris That's, no, it's not. Uh, oh, oh, shit. Oh, my God. It's like fucking frozen time. All right, uh, Brandon, you want me to get your station prepped here? What kind of beer do you want? It's just. Uh, you want, I you want two blue moons? No, just one. Just one? For the whole podcast? Just one. Yeah. Just one for the podcast. Thanks for making me sound like an alcoholic. Oh, okay. All right. I'm but it's true, but I just want one. Blue Moon? Blue Moon? I'll take another one. Sure, why not? I didn't get your Blue Moon last time. It's fine. Shit, fuck. It's fine. Very nice. Blue Moon. My ear is small. I saw you standing alone. It's like fucking Frank sitting right in front of me. An ugly... Worse, Frank. 
So oh no! Woo! Fair, uh, like a Frankenstein. I mean, Sinatra's best features were his eyes, so there you go. You got that going for you, Brandon. Mine's my brown eye, bro. Okay. <laughs> nope. No. <laughs> nope. I'm not. Nope. Can't get down with the brown. Uh, I'm not gonna say anything about that. <laughs> Just let that one slide. Let it slide into the brown. Okay. You're welcome. I can do this all day. Can you? Can you? Okay. I like We're still at four watch crit as Danny and Crystal here. I think Crystal left. Crystal's just gone. He just came in to talk shit. Yeah, he basically he came in to burn Johnny because he saw him wearing a uh, Dolphins <laughs> shirt and he left. <laughs> Got Tony's gone, around. by the way. He just kind of decided to get up and leave. So, uh, yeah, he is, he is, he is uh, talking to his girlfriend. So. And getting us beer. I was going to say, beer in us. Do it. How many more we got? Beer in us? We, we, we got one more. Got one Tuna, more. beer me. <laughs> we got one more. So, have you guys both watched The Office? Yes. Oh, yeah. I finally got Emily to watch The Office. <laughs> Do you not love it? Do you love it? I love oh, it. Oh, fucking Michael Scott. It's one of my so favorites. Good. And that's the thing, even when Michael Scott leaves... It's still it's an not, okay show. Yeah, it's not as good, but it's still good. Yeah, it's it's okay, but... I mean... And the last, that the last, last episode the is chemistry. probably the last Songs. episode is probably the best ending of any show, uh, yes. at least any sitcom. Uh, yes. Michael, you came. That's what she said. <laughs> I can't believe you came. <laughs> yeah, Michael, I can't believe you came. And then the final line he says is like, "It's like all my kids grew up and got married to each other. It's every parent's dream come true." <laughs> yes. So Hi, good. Friend. Hello, Hello. Lily. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Who's this for? One of them is mine. And mine. Oh, yeah. These are for the table, I was told. One more. Joy. One more. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. Ooh, one more. One more. One more. One more, says Johnny. One more beer? One more game. I think he's what he's saying. Do, do, we, do we have enough time? One more game. One more game. Do we have enough time? John wants beer. John wants corn. <laughs> oh, hey, this is you, bro. What's everyone's Shanty spider? <laughs> what a name. Shanty player? Oh, okay. The rooster? Uh, 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 Shanty oh, okay. player. Here, it's right away. You probably don't want me in goal. Awesome. Okay, cool. Sorry. I'll just wire this to you. Thanks. Cool. You don't want me in goal. Fantastic, no, brother. Amiibos. Now you, you can know, uh, that, fight that, the Guardians. I got, so, I got so many Amiibos, yeah. though. More so than the black ones. Yeah, yeah man. Isn't this such Chris a nurse says, I'm sleeping 40 hours. That is a nurse vest. Why is it nursey? Chris, you're the only one missing, man. Fly down here right now. We'll get here in six hours. We'll wait for you. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> she said it to I just felt it. I was like, it's not <laughs> She's like, oh, on, Alan. Well, Alan can't make it, so it's fair enough. He can't. Like, unless he wants to walk here. I don't think that's going to happen. Wait. He does I, live in Minnesota, so that's understandable. The conversations. He's got some car issues. Gotcha. Yep. Oh. Did you see me set that up for him? I I saw you playing with that ball on the way in. Look at me. Check engine light checked one more time. Poor. Look at me. Danny says, hey, Liz. Yeah, you just guided it. I don't think I did that at all. No, that's an assist. Fuck you, it counts. Best friend, Danny. Nothing wrong with assist. BFD. Really is. Hey, so do you have some pretty hot news today, John? Oh, yeah. Okay. Smoking hot. His news <laughs> is. No filter. I'm not John, gonna... uh, give us a preview of the John. <laughs> do you like bread? <laughs> <laughs> yes, I do. Did anybody hear well, my bread my is John still... news that I did? Did anybody listen to it? Oh man. Ooh. Let me know how I did. No, oh, pomegranate. Did you impersonate John when you're saying it? I made sure to do my. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> you guys like. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I love you though. Come on. You did the brownie face. You're too kind. I well, stopped after like four times. What was the. Uh, There's one. My favorite John moment was the uh, movie movie TV shows. Yeah, yeah, movie TV, TV shows. Sh two movie TV shows. <laughs> TV movie shows. TV movie shows. There it is. <laughs> What was it? That was like the beginning of John News. Yep. Oh, that was way. Oh, what a 
<laughs> we say way there. early. We haven't even filmed the 52 episodes yet. Right, now we haven't, we're we so haven't done a year yet. Of so close. Four. So close. Ten, only 10 episodes away. It's actually 51. Nine episodes away. Because we did a zero. That's true. If it's 51, it's been a year. Hit me, hit me, hit me, bro. Be September. Is that is that gonna be our me, is that gonna be our anniversary? We're gonna go back to Cece's Pizza. <laughs> every yeah. anniversary, hit me, bro. Hit me, bro. Hit me, bro. Yeah. <laughs> every anniversary. Oh, he set it up too. <laughs> Shit. No way. <laughs> I like Cece's. If you just pe- if, if you say I like uh, Cece's. Salad, go pizza salad, pizza salad, pizza salad. You're fine. No, you just have to have a lead you. line stomach. That's there the is, only, there is only, only way, way to make that pizza good. It's, it's true. Good. I didn't oh, say it was good. I'm just saying you could eat it if you, you, you no. packet it with some fiber. So. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Yeah. I'm just that's, saying that's you can eat, eat it. It is actually fucking edible, believe it or not. Yeah. But not Technically so is anything if you try hard enough. You're right. This <laughs> table? You could eat I don't, this table. I honestly don't think like plastic would be considered edible, Emily. I'm just sorry. I'm just well, <laughs> sorry to break it to you. Or maybe steel. Goat steel plastic. is edible. This house. Everything in here is edible. I'm just the like, phone. You, if it is small enough, you can swallow it. <laughs> I just heard CC's and now I'm triggered. Where's my oh, safe space? <laughs> help me, Weezy. Help, help me, Oprah. Help me, Tom Cruise. <laughs> 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 oh, Jesus. <laughs> Chris is triggered. CC's, <laughs> it's, it's happening. Help me, Tom Cruise. <laughs> oh, man. I miss Chris. You're going to get to see her next week. Hey, they're coming to the Rock Band for me. Yeah. 819. Go, Johnny, finish it up. <laughs> oh, Johnny! We're gonna need the girl. <laughs> the beautiful game. Tied it up. The girl, Lord. The girl. I was ready for it. But it ended up flying in. I love how proud you were there. Just, 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 <laughs> Is it like Date Mike in the office? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dude, this is a Wendy's. Come on, I have my own date personality. What? Oh, this is my jam. Pump up the volume. Thirty seconds left to go. Got it. Oh, this is my jam. Raising the ball. Round one. <laughs> wedding. Yes. Speaking of the office, that we did watch Perfect. two episodes recently. We gotta watch more of Phyllis's wedding. Yeah, we are. We did the, the, one we did the Bachelor episode. No, you smell no like Tide. Oh, sorry, yeah, sorry, Danny. Right but so that was nice. a technical mix. You're welcome. What do you say? Yes. No, no voices. Yeah, sorry, buddy. That was bad. It's all good. That was Tony's fault. Oh, Blame on him. I was hitting buttons. Uh, oh shit! I don't know. Danny's gonna lose his shit. The volley and back and forth. Johnny, uh, put it in. Captain uh. Brandon oh, what a There it is. <laughs> <laughs> What can I say? If it were Pelican, I won that game. <laughs> 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 Seriously, you said that. Nobody <laughs> understands what it did. I saw it. I saw it. Oh, play of the game, the game. Johnny Pickles, here comes. Watch this. And it's we'll be right back. Watch this. Please stand by. Look at this. Daddy's home. Daddy's home. Daddy's home. All right. Your song. all right, we're going to switch over to the podcast now. We love you all. Good job, Johnny. That was wonderful. Daddy is home. He's about to be on the podcast. So, That's a good movie, too. See ya in a few skis.